Hey, Maggie, you planning on finishing any time this year? Maybe you forgot this was a practice run, not a real race. There's no such thing as not a real race. That's just something people who lose like to say. So, Johnny, what do you think about this course at the Neptune Islands? If practice was any indication, this race is going to be a true test just to finish. Dude, what is that? Huh? I, I'm not quite sure. No, Maggie, look out! Swing back for another pass. Wait, look at that! They're disappearing! Oh, man. I think I speak for all of us when I say, What the heck was that? I couldn't tell you, Zach. I know, where do you think they came from? So according to legend, Maggie was attacked by phantom jets which supposedly haunt the area. Phantom jets? You serious? The Red Invader Squad. A battalion of fighter jets on a mission over the original Neptune Islands. Local legend says they entered a heavy fog and disappeared off the radar, never to be seen again. But sometimes they return in spectral form, still trying to complete the mission they started so long ago. Superstitious mumbo jumbo. There's something else going on here, and I intend to find out what. Enjoy your dinner. Maybe someone should tell those jets the original Neptune Islands were submerged over 40 years ago. Dude, I doubt the afterlife has a messaging service. You don't think they were really ghosts, do you? They did damage to my plane. Technically, phantoms are energy signatures, so maybe there is some truth to the story. How about we all just stop talking about ghost this and phantom that? Let's just change the subject. Nice weather we're having, ain't it? Wait a minute. The fearless Trey Jordan is afraid of things that go bump in the night? I had some ghost issues when I was a kid, but those days are over. Trey Jordan ain't scared of no thing, no how. F phantom Jet! Where? Where? Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so I'm mostly over it. Welcome, race fans, to the new Neptune Islands. Today's big ARC race features plenty of collision potential. Hitting one of the floating spheres can deliver a major teeth-rattling concussion. Avoiding spheres and breathing my jet exhaust? Hey, farm boy, gonna be a tough day. Hard to breathe fumes when you're leading the whole race, Trey. Oh, it is on now. Racers, prepare for air in three. Two, one, Whoa! Oh, that's gonna hurt. Hey, watch it. I'm trying to win a race over here. Man, it's tough to stay in the lead with all these last place stragglers around. Come on, baby. Come on. And Kyle Castle is out of the race, folks. 20 or so more jets get disqualified, it'll be an easier win for me. Whoa! That's not like me. Oh, too bad. Maybe you should have practiced more. This is my race to win. I've just got to concentrate. 
What do you think? I think this is getting stranger by the minute. It was the Red Invader Squad. They took down my jet. Supernatural experts say that phantoms are made up of electromagnetic energy, which is probably what caused your system to malfunction. You don't actually believe these are phantom jets, do you? My beliefs don't enter into it. The locals have reported seeing them. And recently, the sightings have become more frequent. Lucky us. Correct me if I'm wrong, Captain, but I think it's time Metajets got involved. Activate Metagear! Chase! Gardner! Foxtrot! Victor! Phantom Fleet has never actually had contact with other jets before, until now. The system upgrades I made will let us trace different types of energy signatures. Wow, it's the year 2067. I can't believe we're going out looking for phantoms. There has got to be a logical explanation for all of this. That's what we're going to find out. Team, activate Metajets! some phantom jets. These are the coordinates where the phantom jets were last spotted. Let's see if we can pick up any phantom activity. Do you have to keep saying phantom jets all the time? If you're uncomfortable with phantom jets, I guess I can call them spooky planes or banshee bombers or even unidentified flying phantasms. Vector, stop scaring Burner. I'm not scared. Hold on a sec. I'm picking up some hostile poltergeist activity. Are you sure? Where are they? Sorry, Burner, just a bird. My bad. <laughs> Vector, as funny as that was, we need to focus on the mission. I can't help it. How often do I get to rag on Burner? Besides, it's dead quiet out here. <laughs> All right, I get it already. <laughs> Hang on, I found something. Yeah, right. Like, I'm falling for that one again. No, it's real. It's a residual light pattern along the same course the Phantom Jets were going. Okay, Burner and Vector, you guys circle the area and keep your eyes open for any Phantom Jet activity. I'll go with Foxtrot and follow this light pattern to its source. Don't worry, Burner. I'll keep you safe from this scary Phantom. <laughs> Underwater. Switch to aquatic mode and prepare to submerge. Look, there's one of the original sunken Neptune Islands. Nobody could possibly be down here, right? Well, it looks like someone is, and they left the lights on for us. What is a functioning building doing at the bottom of the ocean? We've come this far, might as well find out. Sensors indicate there's breathable air in here. 
Whoever is here definitely knows they have visitors. Burner, Vector, come in, you guys. There must be some sort of jamming signal. I can't radio Burner or Vector. We're on our own. Hello? Wow, Vector would freak out at all the high-tech stuff in here. Hey, check these out. Yikes! It looks like someone's been watching too many monster movies. You were right. This does look like some sort of hoax. You wouldn't believe how <gasps> easy it is to trick those superstitious fools. The name's Shirobi. I would offer you a snack, but I really wasn't expecting visitors. Okay, Shirobi. What exactly are you doing here in a sunken lab? My father was a scientist at this top-secret research facility. He was working on a way to create a holographic weapon system. Holograms that could become solid at will and then fade away, leaving no evidence behind. When the island sank, the project was abandoned. I returned to continue my father's work. So the Phantom Jets were really just holograms? Exactly. They were the earliest forms of the technology that I used to keep nosy islanders away. And it worked. That is, until the ARC Traveling Circus came along. Jet, they certainly pack a very real punch. Shirobi, why are you doing this? I've recently perfected the holographic technology and I'm ready to sell it to the highest bidder. Huh? Uh-oh, that's not good. <laughs> Looks like story time is over. I'm not sure what it is, but maybe we can use it to stop Shirobi. Let's try and get to the Jets. <laughs> no more games. Now! They can dish it out, but let's see if they can take it. I think that question is answered. Jets in one piece. We just have to buy ourselves a little more time. Like this. You missed. Huh, you think so? Whoa. Well played. But do you really think that's going to stop me? Locked. It's time to make an emergency exit. This is far from over. When we broke through that outer door, we must have destabilized the lab. It's in bad shape. I hope Shirobi stopped shooting at us long enough to save himself. I wouldn't worry about that. I have no doubt we'll be seeing him again. I want Shirobi found ASAP. He's too dangerous to be running around loose with his high-tech gadgetry. Speaking of gadgetry... Ooh, give me that! I bet that's an earlier prototype of the hologram device you were talking about. Whoa, awesome! Vector, shut that down until we can properly test it. Captain, you and the 
team better come see this. It just seemed to form out of nowhere, and it's growing larger by the minute. Huh? I think I liked it better when we were hunting phantom jets. Are you sure this is going to work? Guaranteed! I integrated the device directly into your cockpit system controls. Your MetaJet can now take the form of any holographic object you can imagine. Will this device be as powerful as the one Shirovi is using? No, sir. This is like a beta version while his is next generation, but it should hold up. Why does that not reassure me? Come on, Ace! Trust me! Wow, that's pretty cool. No, that's totally cool. Hey, Ace, how you doing in there? I think I'm good to go. Metajets, let's fly. Man, I wish my jet could do that. Head back, team. I want to see if I can reason with Shirobi first. You figured out my prototype device. Very impressive. Unfortunately, it's only half as powerful as this one. Shirobi, what are you doing here? You damaged my lab and destroyed my research. It's payback time. What makes you think we want to fight you? If you don't, I'll send these Neptune Islands to the bottom of the ocean, too. No choice. Meta Jets, attack mode! This is what I've been waiting for. Let's send this robot to the scrap heap. That's what I like. Big targets. A sonic wave blast should be enough to take him down. I don't think so. My hologram technology is built to withstand most energy attacks. Sounds like I'm gonna have to fight fire with fire. Ah, I felt that! That was the point! We could have ended this peacefully, but this is what you wanted! Rule number one, villains never want to end things peacefully. Are you ready to give up now? Give up! Not a chance! Sir, but how exactly are we going to do that? We've hit Shirobi with everything that we've got. Not everything. I have an idea. Let's just hope Shirobi's lab isn't flooded. Luckily, I was able to find a functioning docking port, or this trip would have been for nothing. I'm not sure how much longer I can hold on! We're in luck! It's still online! The Phantom Fleet are good to go! I 
was going to sell my device to the highest bidder, but forget about that now. I love this power! Okay, Foxtrot, send them into Shirobi and we'll end this! Ace! The control's just overloaded! I can't pilot the holograms! Okay, slight change of plans. Did you really think you could run away from me? No, I was just getting you into position. Into position? For what? For this! Look at that! We bagged us another bad guy! You fools ruined everything! Well, well, well. I do all the work and you guys take the credit. Nice job back there, Foxtrot. That was some quick thinking. Hey, all in a day's work! Ah, uh, that's more like it. Looks like the Red Invader Squad has finally been laid to rest. Yeah, never to scare Burner again. <laughs> <laughs>